I think we're going to maintain the same rate of progress, rate of improvement in these models for the second half of the decade as we did for the first. I wasn't so sure about that a couple of years ago. There were new research things to figure out, but now it looks like we'll be able to deliver on that. So if you think forward to, to 2030 and the systems that we can have, um, these systems will be capable of remarkable new stuff. Novel scientific discovery, running extremely complex functions throughout society, um, and things that we just couldn't even imagine as possible before. To, to get there, to be able to deliver on this, uh, it's really going to take you know, these are huge systems now, very complex engineering projects, very complex research. And to keep on this curve of scaling, we've got to work together across research, engineering, hardware, how we're going to deliver these systems and products. Um, and this has gotten quite complex. But if we can do on that, if we, if we can deliver on that, if we can drive this collaboration across the whole industry, we will, we will keep this curve going. And so we're tremendously, work, tremendously excited about the work that we're doing with AMD uh, and what you all are going to deliver to, uh, you know, we'll keep delivering great models.